place looks a little different. But let's go. Yo, what's up squad? Welcome back to the channel. It's your boy Dylan. Guess who's back? It's been a long time coming, but guess who's back? The S2000 is finally back. Parked nice on the driveway. Oh, Lay, it's been so long, but it's finally here. It's time now. <sighs> so y'all, it's finally back. It feels good to be back. Um, since the car went down, it's been about two months since this car was on the road, but we still got some summer left. I actually got a lot of catching up to do with this car. I had so many plans, but because the car went down, all got delayed. So let's get started in today's video. <sighs> Feels good to be back. Let's get started, let's go. Now we got some company, but anyway. Okay, so for today, I just wanna freshen up the car a bit. Um, it's been two months in the shop. The engine bay got really dirty. Let me open it up one time. Y'all see the Momo, it's been so long. But we gotta pop, pop open the engine bay. Gotta clean this car up a bit. Two months of dust. So like I said, I got some catching up to do. The engine bay needs to be cleaned up just a little bit. We got a few finishing touches to do. Um, I also got some new parts that have to go onto the car, so I gotta install those. Yeah, we got a few things to do just before the summer ends, and um, let's get started today. So here are the goodies. All right, so let's tidy up the engine bay. First thing on the list, we got this spoon radiator cap sticker. As you guys know, I got a new radiator cap. Sticker wasn't on there, so I'm gonna do the honors and put it on. So let's do that real quick. Damn, that actually made a little difference. Check this out. So just that little sticker right here, I think it makes the engine bay look better. It looks more drippy, it looks more official. Let me know what you think. That's the first thing on the list. Let's go on to the next one. All right, so up next we got this Jay's Racing oil cap to go with the Jay's Racing valve cover. We gotta make this engine bay drippy, we're not done. Let's get it, let's do this one. So for this, I'm actually gonna put the oil cap on first, then we'll line up the Jay's Racing sticker to go with it, so that's what we're gonna do. Ah, that hurt. My leg. So out with the old, put that out of here. Comes with a little gasket in there. Put this new one on. Oof, it's already drippy. There we go. A little bit tight. Boom, that's it. I got the sticker in the spot that I want it. Looks good to me. Shift that over a bit. Press down on it. Let's go lock it up. Sheesh, it's getting better, guys. Two little things done. On to the next one. Time to put back the spark plug cover or coral pack cover. Let's do that. coming together. I know the gold here doesn't match, but I wanted a Jay's Racing oil uh, oil cap, and there wasn't many options. I could have got silver, but I felt like it would have looked weird with the gold. So I went with gold, kept it gold. That's the engine, that's the gold right here. And um, yeah, so it's looking good. On to the next thing to do. 
next thing to do, I don't know if you can see it on camera, but this right here is super dirty. Like I said, two months. Um, I need to repolish all of this aluminum. So that's what we're gonna do and get this all nice. So for aluminum, I got a product that I've been trying out. It's called Mothers. Some of you might know this, but it's an aluminum polish and it's, so far it's been working good for me. So I'm gonna use this, clean this up, and this engine base should look fire. longer than a few minutes later so with a little bit of elbow grease and some time now all these things are fully polished looking shiny that's what I'm talking about Jeez. so there it is that's the engine bay for now um, yeah, everything is clean now. When I first got the car, everything was super dusty. I already did my thing by wiping down the valve cover, the intake. So it was worse than this before. So I already did my thing. Um, up next, I think this has to go. The red is kind of throwing off everything. The purple coupler, I'm gonna keep that. I like it. Um, but yeah, this is the engine bay for now. Happy to have the car back. We all clean. So I actually lied to y'all. I have one more thing, which is this. Let's put this on. It's a little cherry on top. So here it is, complete engine bay. I had to add the spoon reservoir cover. Looks super sick. We got spoon, we got J's, we got everything going on here. Just getting started, just having fun with this car and happy to have it back. So that's it for today. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'll probably continue up tomorrow. Um, I just wanted to show you guys that the car is back. I actually had all those little things for months, but because we didn't have the car, I couldn't put them on. But now we finally got it done. Got some more in store. I got some more mods to put in the car. We got a set of coilovers to do. We got the spoiler to do. A few more things coming up, so make sure you stay tuned. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Drop a like for the S2000 coming back. Stay tuned for future content. We got those mods coming up. Make sure you subscribe. I will catch you in the next one. I'm out. Peace.